Welcome to Fave Crafts 365, your daily video log report about things happening here at FaveCrafts.com. I'm Maria Nerius, the resident craft expert and your host. We get a lot of questions at FaveCrafts.com and recently one of our readers uh, asked us, she said she had made an oil lamp from a conch shell, rather large conch shell. They drilled the hole. There is an area for uh, a reservoir. That to hold the oil that the lamp will burn and she had the proper wicking she had the proper clip on top everything was right but the lamp did not work so we all brainstormed a little bit and this is basically an oil lamp you have to have uh, an area where the oil uh, can stay you see inside there's wicking and of course you have this has a ceramic top that's the wick and you also have this clip that clips everything into place, so everything's holding. So, uh, at first I thought, okay, well, send me pictures. Maybe it's that the hole was drilled in an area that it's very difficult for the wick um, to, to draw that oil up. And she said, no, she saturated it. Everything should be fine. That baby should be lightened, and it's not. My final comment was, start all over again. Uh, clean out the lamp. Remove the wicking, put in new wicking, put in new oil. And make sure that that oil is the type that's meant to be in an oil burning lamp. Well, lo and behold, she did discover that she had put the incorrect oil in. And that's very easy to do because when you go to a craft store or you go to the area that has candles, there's all kinds of oils there. There's essential oils, there's fragrance oils. Um, you name it, it's there. They all kind of look the same. But if you're going to put together your own oil lamp, and I thought that was a very clever way to use a, a conch shell, which is a very large shell, just make sure that all the different materials that you need are the correct ones for a job. And in the future, I'll go into even this wick. There's all different kinds of wicks. Did you notice that if you've ever gone into the uh, candle supply area? and lamp making area you'll see there's all kinds of different wicking and there's a reason for that but for today we're glad that we could solve that problem and somewhere out there there's somebody burning a beautiful handmade conch oil lamp from all of us here at favecrafts.com we're wishing you a very creative day